Today is Queen Elizabeth's final farewell to the UK. Right now, tens of thousands of mourners are filing past the Queen's coffin at the historic Westminster Hall. Officials have warned the lines could take up to 30 hours to get through, but so far it's been moving at a steady clip. ABC's Faith Abube is in London with the latest. An extraordinary scene in central London. Thousands queued in a miles long line to see Queen Elizabeth's coffin. Security, want to see those wristbands? The route snaking along the River Thames, passing over a bridge and then around Parliament. You're a troublemaker. We met Katie and Joshua four hours into their journey with about three more to go. The two strangers just hours ago, now friends taking in this moment in history together. I think it's lovely to be able to talk to people yeah, yeah, yeah. and just, you know. Yeah. I can even say that the Queen brought us together, not only with her, but many of us we have become one. Many waiting in the line telling us similar stories of new friendships as they inch closer and closer to Westminster Hall to bid final farewell to Queen Elizabeth. The closer they get, the more solemn the mood. Inside, guards holding vigil by the Queen's coffin as well-wishers pass by. The mourners paying their final respects in their own ways, bowing, signing the cross, or saying a prayer for the late monarch. I started with the Lord's Prayer and I, I, I couldn't finish it. It, was, it. it just took over. Seeing that coffin with the Queen in it, obviously I've met her a few times and it's just too much for me. We saw Lisa dabbing her eyes, walking out six hours after she got in line to see the only monarch she's ever known. And she was such a lovely lady. And we'll all miss her. Sorry. Yeah. But I'll be okay. It's just upsetting. And we're told King Charles and his siblings will hold a 15-minute vigil for their mother tomorrow afternoon. At Buckingham Palace, Faith Abube, ABC News.